Hello and welcome to Angel Hair and Makeup. Today we're going to do a Christmas lip. I'm going to start by exfoliating the lip. I'm putting honey all over the lip. I'm going to work it in. I'm adding some brown sugar on top of the honey. This is going to help exfoliate the lip. I'm going to massage it all over the lip and all around the mouth. It will get rid of any dry skin get rid of any chapped lips. It will plump the lips up, make them appear bigger. It will bring blood to the area. It will make them nice and rosy. So I'm just massaging the honey and the brown sugar into the skin surrounding the lip and now I'm going to remove it with a damp face cloth. So already you can see that the blood is flowing to the lips and they already look plumper. Now I'm going to add some serum. This is CBD oil that I got in Aldi. You can use any kind of oil. I also like coconut oil. I'm going to massage it in all over the lips. This is going to hydrate the lips, bring moisture to the area. I'm going to remove any excess oil with a damp face cloth. Now the lips are prepped and primed for their lips stick. I'm going to use a lip liner. I'm using red as I want it to be a Christmas look. I'm going to draw a crisscross at the cupid's bow. And this will give me my highest point. Now starting at the outside corner, working my way up towards the crisscross. This will stop me from dragging down the outer corners. So drawing upwards towards the cupid's bow and then I'm going to fill in the entire lips with the lip liner. Making sure you get those inside corners. It doesn't matter if you go outside, we can clean up with concealer afterwards. The lip liner is going to give longevity to the lipstick, make it last longer. So fill in the entire lip starting at the outside corners and working upwards. And fill in the entire mouth. So working at the outside corners and working into the middle of the lip. Again, you can see here I'm overdrawing on this bottom lip. As we get older, the lip line starts to recede. The skin around the lip starts to go white. So I'm drawing onto that skin that has gone white. It used to be pink when I was younger. So I'm overdrawing and filling in entire lip with the lip liner. Again, I know it looks messy. Don't worry, we're going to clean it up with concealer after the fact. I just want to make sure that all of the skin is covered with the lip liner. And then I'm going to go and put on some lipstick. So using a flat head stiff makeup brush, I'm going to coat it on both sides with the lipstick. And I'm going to paint that all over the lip liner. Really work it into the lips. Pushing it in with the makeup brush will make it last longer. So always try to come up from the outside corner up towards the cupid's bow so that we don't drag down the outside corners. We want to bring them upwards. Just filling in any gaps, especially with red as when you talk, the red tends to wear off a little bit quicker. So by lining the lips and by using the brush to put the uh, 
lipstick on, it's going to last a little bit longer. I'm just using the brush to get more detailed. Now I'm going to go in with some concealer on another flat head makeup brush and coating both sides of the makeup brush with the concealer. Just using the back of my hand as a palette. And now I'm going to clean up all around those outside corners. This will get a nice, definite, sharp line for your lipstick. So again, I'm going to go over this concealer with foundation, so I don't need to be too careful with the concealer. I just want to make sure that I get a nice, crisp line around the outside of the mouth. Getting rid of anywhere that I came out too far. And I'm just going to work it in with my finger. Get rid of any harsh lines. Now getting some foundation on a sponge. Going right up towards the lip line just to sharpen it up a little bit more and clean up any areas that need to be clean. Push that foundation in. There you go. Nice juicy red lips for Christmas. I hope you enjoyed.